is our front door. We have a little window out here. Our front porch is way bigger than the one I had in California, so a lot to do. Um, our front door is oak, and they stained it, and then we have glass that you can't see through. Um, like very well but that sticker we still have to remove that my husband they want to get goo gone you come in and we have this very tall grand entryway i love our flooring and then here is our pretty stairs they are like a wood and a metal and i really love that and then a little window here. And then you go down. That's the view from the stairs. So pretty. And then this is a half bath. The mirror in there, we're gonna replace that. But just a little half bath on this side. So I can do something fun in there. And then this is the box. We got a refrigerator in. We got a GE profile, which is really, really nice. But it came with a little dent. So they are going to have to, um, they're going to give us a new one tomorrow. They're bringing us a new one and taking this old one. So then you go. This is the kitchen. I love, love, love my granite. Here you go. I'll step back so you can see. We got our refrigerator. We're gonna get the same one, but um, it just won't have a dent in it. And we have a box there. My cabinets, let's get closer, are this beautiful like gray color and I have all the gray hardware. And then this is my tile. It's like a gray large subway tile and I love it. And with the wood floor. And then let's go check out my pantry. My pantry is really big. We just threw stuff in here because of course we have nothing. But I figured if I don't film this empty house tour, I'll never get to it. So this is all we have in here. And it's the two doors and it's really, it's pretty large. Our pantry, double doors. And then over here is the laundry room. Here we have like a gray tile. Our washer and dryer also, they actually come in today. And then we have this little bar, this little wood bar oops, for me to hang up stuff. And I just have paper towels up there so far. Yeah, that. And I don't even know if those are gonna stay there. And then on this wall, this door is the super heavy door that leads to our garage. We got a broom. And then on this wall, I actually, cause it's like you come in from the garage, I wanna do like a focal wall with some hooks on there. So I think we could do something really cute on this wall. So like Brooklyn can hang her backpack out of after school and all of that stuff. So let's go back into the house. Love, love, love my floors. And then over here, so I'll have like three bar stools at the island. And then over here, this is actually our table top. And these are the legs. They still need to be stained. And the boys are working on a skirt. I'm going to do window treatments, one big one for this. So one long rod for that. But that's our new table. Um, this is the underside. It's just got a um, like a clear stain on the other thing. I want it to go with light, bright, and kind of airy. So that's it. I'm thinking on this wall, I'll do some floating shelves, but I'm not sure. I just wanna do something. And then, so the wood table, the legs still need to be seen. That's why they're so light. And then I'm going to have a rug here, of course, and then chairs. And then this just leads right into the big old living room area. And all we have here so far is my new coffee table. So that's my new coffee table. Of course, we'll have like an area rug here. We'll have my couch and then the fun and then windows here again as well. And then we wanna do 
I'm gonna do one big fun window treatment. And then over here, this is a piece of barn wood and it has some of those lighter tones. Um, and this is like from like 1870 and I'm pretty sure I said that right, but that is actually gonna serve as my mantle and they're gonna make me a big focal mantle wall here. This right here is the insert for the fireplace. But we'll have that going on on this wall, like a cute, really fun focal piece. The entryway, I forgot to show you the coat closet. So we have this, <laughs> nothing done to it yet. It's really, really big. My husband just has a cooler in there. My mom has her purse hung up and just has that little rack. So well, lots of storage. It's my backyard. We have a covered patio. The grass just got watered. So we have those. We said we may replace those out for two ceiling fans back here and actually enclose in this patio. But here is just grass and a pretty fence. This piece. And then a pretty fence. And then we have a little tree there. And then that, I love that little um, stone wall. Brooklyn is asleep in my bedroom. So um, her room, the boys worked on it and painted it last night. So I'll show you, show you our room. So just random towels that I had. I love our, it's like our gray brick tile floor, our double vanity. This is the only thing I've bought so far from Target. Um, and then there's like a white granite in here. Um, here is the water closet, the shower. My husband just finished taking a shower. He's at Home Depot. The humongous, I think it's humongous. I only have toilet paper in here right now. The um, closet and then this closet is a hot mess but I'm trying to talk low because um, we just threw our stuff in here but it is pretty big my husband just threw clothes up there our stuff doesn't come for a few days so we are yeah we have a few hangers I can hang up some things but pretty big walk-in closet, but all of our stuff is just thrown on the floor right now. Master, I didn't get to show you that, but it's just like a master bedroom. But let's walk, let me get this light off. But let's go um, upstairs, we're back at the entryway. And then I love, 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 love the carpet that we picked, all speckled so it doesn't show dirt and stains. So let's go upstairs. We have this humongous area up here. That mattress is for one of, Brooklyn has like a trendle bed that's coming. Um, and the mattress just needed to finish poofing up. So we left it out here because the boys were painting in her room last night. But a very huge room. We're gonna put a sofa here. The TV's gonna go on that wall. Here, I think we'll put my husband's desk and all that stuff. Well, it's the family's, like, computer. Let's go in Brookie's room first. So yesterday, the boys put up the board and batten, and they put all of the rooms up here are kind of like the same style. And then they painted her wall this pink color, which she's super excited for. And then all of the, there's three bedrooms up here. And then all of the closets are, and we just have stuff thrown, are the same. They have the thing and the ledge. And they're all pretty much the same size with the double doors. Every people are sleeping, so we're not going to go in there. We do have this closet. We just have paper towels in here right now. And that, and this is pretty big for like linen storage.
This is the bathroom. Where's the light? So nothing we've done. We don't even have a shower curtain. So they have tile here as well. I gotta get a shower. I got a shower curtain, but I don't have a rod. I wind up picking this one up from Hearth and Hand. And then this bathroom. It's pretty big. And then I pick up soap from <laughs> Hearth and hand as well, the little soap and lotion, but that's all I have for this bathroom. Cut that off. This is my son's room. Nothing in it so far. He was sleeping on a cot because we don't have any of our stuff. Um, all the bedrooms do have the carpet as well. And then he has a double closet too. So they're all about the same size. I'll give you an overview. It's so this will be like Brooklyn's play area. Like I said, TV there, sofa here, some storage, and then that door is my son's door. That's hers, and then this area over here is the guest room, and that's the mattress that goes in her room. We're just waiting for it um, to puff up and her room to dry because the boys painted it yesterday. And then just like when people move in, we just have toilet paper sitting there. And a bucket of toys so that is it for this area and that's kind of your view when you look down it goes way up so I tried to give a house tour I, I know I hope I didn't I, I really didn't get to show the master bedroom but I'll be making individual videos on all of the different stuff so you guys will get to see everything as it comes along but this is a semi empty house tour well pretty much empty thank you guys for watching bye